Okay guys, in this video I'll explain how to solve these errors. The 1101, 1103, also the 1104, which are the most common errors when you do an HTTP petition and it is incorrect or also when you have an internet connection. Okay, here in the app, I, I have a little exam with get post and put. And what it do is a petition to Google. And then what they read, it's printed on the label. Okay, if we put a get, it gives us all the HTML. Also with the post and the put. And it doesn't mark error, but for example, if we want to connect to toggle.com, it doesn't exist. We click on get, and it appears the error 1101, that is this. Okay, it isn't possible to check the connection or the validity of the URL using only the web tool. The unique way is by catching the error with this. Error occurred, and here we put an if, only to compare. In this case, the errors are the 1101 and the 1103. So we can put an or and equals. If the error is equals to 1101, or the number 1103 and here you can put whatever you want a notification to get back the screen or something in this case I'll put uh, this message oops there is a connection error and that's it so if we put set to this which is it doesn't exist and if I uh, found the error oops there's an error connection you can put another message like the URL is down site doesn't exist or you have an interconnection an error gives the number 1101 or 1103 respectively if it's a get or post I don't know the block post file gives us the error 1104, but it, it is also an URL error. The way to solve this error is with this form. There is not an exact way uh, to solve this with the web tool. But this is the easier way to solve it. Okay, that's all for this video. Don't forget to get subscribed to activate the notifications to watch the new videos. Okay, bye.